hello guys so in this video i'm going to be showing you how to get your presets from your email i sent everybody this email everybody that mailed me today i sent you this email so i'm going to be showing you how to get the presets from these three images that i put here now the these images i put here have the presets embedded in them so your job is just to move it from here to your lightroom extract the preset and then use it on your own images so i'm going to be clicking on the first image it's going to tell you unsupported file type and that's because your phone is used to png not dng so now what you do is you click on this um, box here that has the arrow facing up it's going to show you several apps you click on lightroom launch your lightroom and then we wait for the picture to get imported into lightroom great it's here so you can see that this picture says dng but the other pictures don't say the only pictures here that are that have presets on them are the ones that you can see saying dng and it's just these two so now i'm going to click on that one that we just imported and you click on these three dots up here it gives you these options so you you click on create preset because we're about to create a new preset so i'm going to name it i'll name it uh, deborah presets one we save now it has been added to our user preset so you can now now you already have that preset you already saved it so now you have to find a picture that you want to use the preset on so i'm going to be using this one because i haven't edited this picture at all so now i click on presets click on the one i just saved which is deborah preset one you can see how the image just changed so now this is what it was before and this is it now so you can see the difference in the image is a lot beautiful a lot sharper the colors are bold so you can when you have presets the smart thing to do is to make sure that the pictures that you're applying it on almost have the same color lighting sorry the same colors the same lighting but maybe not necessarily the same colors but lighting is very very important now the preset i use for an image i shot outside most likely cannot be used for an image i shot inside the house because the preset the lighting is completely different i'm going to be showing you um also how you can use the preset on other images and how it changes you know i mentioned something about colors so that picture i edited this one has more yellow and brown this one has more blue so let me show you what it looks like when i put the deborah preset that we just created so you can see because in that other picture it brightened all of the yellow in this other you can see here that all the yellows are really bright in this other picture now it's made the blue to pop very well so what i can do now is to come to color here click on this mix click on my blue and adjust it just bring it back a bit so that the blue doesn't look too fake you see how over blue it is great so you can just bring it back a little so the blue doesn't look too fake this is what the picture was before this is it now when you've edited so this is what your preset can do for you it can help you have an even look on all of your pictures thank you